Hey guys, welcome to vlog 3. Today I want to talk to you about a serious topic that I found out about not from watching news but from the internet. <gasps> the internet is a big uh, place and you can find out a lot of things on it. Yeah, I'm stating the obvious. And the topic that I want to talk about is bullying. And there was this incident with a woman by the name of Klein, or Klein. Uh, I'm not sure how to say her name. And she's a 68 year old woman in upstate New York who was a, or is a bus monitor on a uh, school bus with kids in 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th grade and he was bullied and I have a connection to this story when I was younger and thankfully I wasn't bullied for being you know interested in men but I was bullied for being you know annoying being different um, not being the most social butterfly in the world being a social outcast uh, stuff like that so I definitely know what bullying feels like I was punched I was teased verbally mentally physically um, some of the, my teachers never respected me helped me um, I honestly barely got through high school and it's still a, a big accomplishment that I actually got through college and got my psychology degree and it's one of my proud accomplishments and you should go to college if you haven't gone to college yet um, but that's why I want to go to more college and get my graduate degree and get a master's degree in psychology but that's besides the point this woman is a 68 year old grandmother of eight um, she's I hate to say it but she's obese and um, she was just sitting there and she didn't start anything but those kids just started insulting her, calling her fat, poking um, with their books, uh, saying that she should die and that nobody loves her and blah, 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 blah. And it was um, heartbreaking to watch, you know, the little clips of CNN and CBS and Channel 7 News broadcasting things about that and if you want to see like one example that I'm gonna show you I'm gonna annotate one of them and you'll see you know that she was bullied and it's unbelievable it lasted like 10 minutes and 20 minutes who knows how long and the only reason why people know about this is because one of the stupid little smart kids filmed it on his cell phone and uploaded it to YouTube just like I'm going to upload this video he uploaded it to YouTube and it went viral in minutes. If that kid did not upload the video, she would have never gotten this much publicity. And the good thing about this, uh, at the very least, is uh, uh, she got donations from, uh, I mean, I don't know the story, uh, full story. But she got donations of like 40, 450,000 just to go on vacation. She was only expecting like 5,000 to go on a you know, pretty good vacation. But now she has enough money to retire. She should not go back to that job. I'm sh sure she was a very good person. She didn't react at all. She cried a little bit and that obviously instigated more insults from the kids and stuff like that. All she wants from them is an apology. All she wants from them is to be punished for the summer, get community service, or don't let them participate in athletic things in school, stuff like that. And she's not uh, charging them with criminal charges. And she's just a dear old lady with eight grandchildren of her own. And. Um, bullying if you're ever bullied do not just sit down and take it obviously if you react that puts more fuel on the fire and it's not gonna solve a thing everybody tells you go tell teacher go tell your parent and stuff like that 
obviously it's the last thing you you actually want to do mentally but it's the first thing you should do I never believed it and I never went for help to anybody which is why I had to fight my own battles but here I am telling you you got to tell somebody you trust friends family whatever actually don't tell friends because friends will just instigate things but um, yeah so she's going on a, a probably a huge vacation God knows where and then she's probably gonna retire but nobody knows because there's a there's no updates for that and the only thing that's happening right now is one of the kids um, that actually saw the video after it got uploaded was like oh I'm very sorry that I did that I cannot believe that I did that and I am so ashamed and I wish I could take it back and I'm so sorry yeah right what I'm thinking is he just said that just to get away with an apology and the father of the kid was like I cannot believe my son is capable of doing that and that father even talked to the woman clan or clan whatever her name is that got affected by this it's unbelievable how are American parents teaching their children to treat others do you realize that American children are getting worse and worse and worse homosexual rights are getting limited uh, even though recently you know states are kind of lifting the anti-gay marriage right uh, no right things they're they're lifting it at this point I, I'm very happy that they're doing that but it's totally not enough o Obama um, it's get political a little bit is kind of not fully doing his job uh, you can see all the campaigns that are going on right now on the TV commercials you can government is going to it's going crazy so I don't know what to tell you guys but um, I think America even though it's some things it's going in the right direction some things it's not parents are not teaching kids how to treat their elders with respect um, there's definitely generation we're going to be fucked over um, obviously I've been looking for a job for a year and obviously looking for a job has nothing to do with bullying but there there's a correlation somewhere there has to be not a causation but a correlation who knows what's going on in this world and then uh, you know other countries look at us and they're like how can we let a woman like this be treated like this how are Americans raising their children like this and then people immigrate to America thinking they're gonna have a better life and then this happens I all right guys this was my um serious vlog for uh, this week I don't usually do serious vlogs I was actually gonna film this yesterday but I kind of wanted to see if there was gonna be like a little update today first and <clears throat> obviously there isn't and if anything I've said in the video is you know not correct on the updates please let me know in the comments below if you have any uh, response to you know a situation that happened with this woman please also leave me a video response or comment below something like that <clears throat> also you guys are forgetting to actually like my video when you leave a comment or view it so please click the like button I even gave you an annotation on my second video and you guys didn't like it so please like my video and also please uh, read my descriptions because my fan page link is there on Facebook and my petition for AdSense is there please sign it and like my page and I, of course at the end of this video I will make a reminder for you um, 
So Anne again, please let me know uh, if you can see any differences with me having my mic on. Okay, and I will see you guys Monday. Goodbye! Mm -hmm.